this is Big Bad Bot and today I'm going to review not only one, but two portable Rayman games. We have Rayman Advance for the Game Boy Advance and Rayman 3D for the 3DS. We have a good game and a bad game. No really, this game is bad. But before we get on to the bad game, let's go on to the good game. Rayman Advance. This is a port of the original Rayman. Man. And a good one as well. Wait, I'm just gonna put this in. Oh, I put it in the wrong way. Let's play. Let's, let's play this again. I think there's something wrong with the cartridge. Well, I think it's not working. King. Before watching this review, please watch my review of the first Rayman game. Game. Because I'm not going to talk about the whole thing over again. I'm, I want English. First off, I've gotten further in this game than I have with Rayman. Man one. I mean, it's easier. First off, look, you, your your max health points is six, and your normal is four. In the original, regular was three. And four was five. The music's pretty good. It doesn't have every song from the original Rayman, but it does have a few. This camera angle, this is kind of hard to do. I'm so sorry, my arm is hurting. I definitely like the music in the game. I got over there, but I'm gonna stop now. The graphics are nice, the game's easier. I'll show you what level I'm stuck on on the original Rayman, the PlayStation version. I've never gotten past this level. This level is from hell in the PlayStation version. But it's easier thanks to more health, more beginning lights, and more continues. Continues. The graphics are still nice, the music's good, and the gameplay's the same. The controls are just as good, and overall it's a great game. You should definitely check it out. One quick thing. Yeah. I thought you laughed. And it's more focused on Rayman, the camera is. Kind of like Sonic Genesis. The music's definitely better than that game. Overall, it's, it's, it's a better port in my opinion. It gets a 7.7 .7 out of 10. I think you should definitely check this version out. Now we got that game out of the way, let's play the Bahahard game. Rayman 3D. Now you might be asking yourself, why is this game so Bahahard? I'll tell you why it's so Bahahard. It's a port of Rayman 2. I love Rayman 2, but this game is just not as good as Rayman 2. I'm serious. Let's put this in my 3DS. And I'm going to turn the volume down because you all know how loud that thing is. From my Game Watch Gallery review and my 
the Spyro <laughs> Eternal Night review on review. So let's play this game. It's a Rayman 2 clone. I mean, come on! Seriously, Nintendo! No, seriously! You let Ubisoft port this game onto the 3DS. It was port. It was originally ported on the DS. Why did you have to do it on your 3D console? It's just silly. Rayman 2 is definitely the most popular in the series, Reese, But and this is just a disappointment. I mean, that's all. Is that's the only thing that's at the bottom screen, along with a little more detail. No. AJS, that's me. <laughs> that's nice artwork. There's one problem with this game. I mean, there's a world map system. You might think it's easier to get through the levels like this, but they remove levels. And even worse, you're not going to believe this, but they remove the hub world as well. Well, I think they remove levels. There's no more voice acting. 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 That's all that's at, on the bottom. That's all. That's the only thing. That's all on the bottom of, of the screen. Hmm. Some levels are done in the wrong order, I think. I've only gotten through a little bit. They removed the voice acting, which in my, which in my opinion, it's a sad thing. Once again, you can't skip the cutscenes. I'm talking about the original Rayman 2 at this point. The graphics are just as impressive, and it, and it has the same music, but the gameplay is kind of disappointing, in my opinion. Yeah. Because it's just not as fun as Rayman 2. I'm serious. Serious. <laughs> if, if I had the voice acting, it wouldn't be as bad. Controls. B to jump and Y to shoot. I'll talk more about this game when I review... Rayman Revolution, which is basically the PS2 version of Rayman 2. So, I know it's late, but, but come on, this game is kind of disappointing. I mean, I'd rather play the original Rayman 2 any day. It's kind of disappointing. The game's kind of boring compared to the original. Overall, I just don't like it. I mean, it's a port of Rayman 2, and it's not a very good one either. Well, at least it doesn't use touch 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 see screen controls. I meant. Overall, I just don't like this port. You like this port? That's fine with me. I just wanted to die. Overall, Rayman Advance graphics get an eight out of ten. Music gets an eight out of ten. Controls, I forgot. A to jump, B to attack, and R to, well, do the funny face. Yes. So 7 out of 10, replay value gets a 7 out of 10, overall I give that game a 7.7 out of 10. This game, graphics get an 8 out of 10, music gets an 8, I mean 7 out of 10. It's kind of disappointing compared to the original, just a little disappointing compared to Rayman 2. To gameplay, gets a 4 out of 10, I kind of found it boring. Replay value gets a 5 out of 10. You won't want to play this a lot. And fun fact, it gets a 3 out of 10. It's not that fun. And this game gets a drum roll, please. 3.9 out of 10. This game's boring. This game's good.
get out of my sight. Thanks for watching this review. I hope you enjoyed it. This is Big Bang Bot signing out.